They're not actually any more closely related to a wolf spider than a black widow spider is related to a wolf spider. And this is a male, you can see the pelps on the front of his face there, mm -hmm. those things that people think are fangs. This is a really common question, I get asked this all the time. No matter where I am and what time of year it is, people ask me about the giant wolf spiders that come in the house to get out of the cold. And so both those things aren't true. They're not wolf spiders and they're not coming in to get out of the cold. They're looking for mate and they're actually a funnel web spider. And they're introduced from Europe. Okay, so why do we seem to be finding more and more of them as the fall and fall approaches? Mating season for spiders. So and this is when he's mature and the females are mature and they're gonna mate and then both of them will probably die after she's produced eggs and then next year new spiders. This time of year, just put them outside if they come in. They're not trying to come in to get out of the cold and you should try to save energy by putting a sweep under your door, keep the spiders out and uh, think of spiders as your allies. They're, they're predators. All spiders are predators so they eat the things that we don't like like earwigs and wood bugs I think most people who uh, compassionately remove a spider from their home do it with a glass over the spider and then a piece of paper under the glass and then they just transfer it outside. There are 1,500 species of spider known from Canada and in British Columbia we're estimating that at least a thousand of them occur here. So we definitely have the diversity here.